Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So for the past few days, I was working on this prototype which is simulating gravity on the moon surface. In this video, I will be explaining you on how to get the gravity right in Unreal Engine so that it feels like uh, we are walking on the surface of the moon. So we start off by having this Epic Games launcher. So once you have the Epic Games launcher, we just have to install Unreal. So I am using Unreal 4.24.3. So we, get, we need to get the launcher first and then here you can uh, go to Unreal Engine and then launch it once you have it installed. So once you have the uh, Unreal Engine running, you just need to uh, select games with next and then use a template so for this tutorial i'll be using a first person template and then with some c++ so because we need to work with c++ code and, uh, because, and then we just choose a uh, location for the set of folder and then we need to name the project let me name the project as gravity sync then create the project So once the project is created, uh, you will have a standard uh, first person template. You can just play around. Uh, as you can see, I can walk around, I can jump, and this is uh, similar to how it's. Um, so you can just jump. Now, in order to change the gravity, we just need to go to uh, world settings, and once you are in world settings, you just uh, need to override the world gravity. So once you get the world overriding the world gravity, you need to change the value to some negative value, minus 250. Then uh, let's see how it plays out. Let's like hit. As you can see, I'm, I'm like jumping way higher, but uh, running seems to be uh, similar to how it's on the Earth surface. So running is not affected. So, but jumping is simulating somewhat which is equal to the moon surface so once let's try to work with the running wires so, so we'll just go to uh, just find the first person character and open the full group grid editor so here we need to go to character movement and change the walk speed. Let's change, let's change the jump velocity to 250 or something. And uh, let's reduce the walk speed. The walk speed, yeah, that walk speed. So let's reduce it to 300. So that we get a bit of force. Save it out. So it, so it, there is kind of a friction now. He walks slower. And this lower surface. So, but now, like we need, to, we need to add some jump when he's walking. It doesn't, it doesn't look like he's walking on the surface. So let's try to work with that now. So for that, we need to uh, jump into the code. So you go to C++ classes here, same, and then you have the gravity sync character. Click on that. Once you have the gravity sync character, you need to find where the Code for walking and uh, walking is basically where the code for the input action uh, working. So that is move forward. So it is binded by move forward method and move right method. So let's go to move forward method and, and move forward. Uh, there's a, a movement added here. So it's nothing uh, fancy. We just need to add a jump along with moving forward. So let's let's add, add the jump method. And then we like to you can either create a new method or you can just use the existing jump method. So when you're walking, it feels like you're jumping too. And then once you're done with that, let's just compile the code and check how it is. You can either compile here or you can build it from the project itself. Build something like that. So anyway, works. Once you're done with that, let's play and see how it works. 
and you can see it's like walking slowly and it's jumping too so it feels like you know it's just it's just pretty sweet